Welcome back guys, to the new tutorial of Coder Garage. In this tutorial we will see how to get a button here in the app. In addition to this we will also see how to have button in the corner and in the center, in a single tutorial. If you haven't watched the tutorial of setting the app bar bottom bar with text and the background image. Click this notification icon to watch these. Before going into this. Like and subscribe the video if you liked it. Comment the part which you don't like. Let me resume from the previous video of setting the background image. First let me show how to get the icon in the bottom corner of the screen. Below the body, use the floating action button widget. Let me run this code to show the changes when using this widget, so here you can see that the button in blue, which you see in the Flutter demo code. We should always define the function of the button within on pressed when using it. Now let me just use print as an action. Let me run this code. Now you can see that it prints the statement, when we clicked the button. Now, let me, add an icon within the button. Use the child property to add icon in the button. So now we have added the icon. But the button is not visible, as both the background and button were the same color. Now let me change it to a contrast color. Use the background color property to change the color of the button. Here let me set it to white color. Since both the icon and the button were the same color, the icon is not visible, so let me change the icon color now. So the button is now ready with the icon, let me do some more effects on the button. The special widget of this tutorial is splash color, let me explain this in detail. Let me set the color to amber, which is in contrast to all the colors in the screen, so you can note the changes. Now on clicking this button you can see the effect. The wait is over, now we will see how to get the button in the center and in the top. To get the button in the top and center, you need to use the floating action button location property. Fix the location by using a dot. So here are the various locations, where you can place the button, the default location is end float. If you need the button in the center, use center float. Here, you can see the space between the bottom bar and the button. Use center dock to avoid the space. Now let me show how to get the button in the top. Use mini start top to get the button in the top. So now you can see the button in the top. Thank you for watching, like and subscribe.